Yes, many 4-H members made the trip here to State Fair to show off their cows or even their horses. But some of the competitors tell me that this year they had to choose because they couldn't bring just one animal. I just brought the one that I think is going to do the best. Meet John Halowinski and his Jersey cow, Serena. She's just got the quality that you're looking for in a show animal. She's just got all the right traits in her, and she just got, she's got style to her. This pair came all the way from Shawano County. It wasn't easy, nor was it cheap. It did cost a lot of money to, for all of us to come here. Transportation, hay, and food for the cows are costly here at State Fair. But the real expense is what it costs when a cow isn't on the farm producing milk. As far as the dairy industry, the milk price has been really bad. The cow, farmers are averaging losing $100 a cow a month. So it's tougher to uh, send the animals down. John wanted to bring another cow to show, but can't afford it this year. If I was better off just leaving that animal home so she can make milk at home to provide income for the farm. Plus, John has faith that Serena has what it takes to bring home the blue ribbon. Last year, she took fifth place. So you think she has a chance to move up and even win this year? I hope so. I think she does. She's really developed into a nice, fine young cow. And State Fair officials tell me that they have just as many livestock here this year as they have any other year. They think that maybe there are more families, but just bringing fewer animals. Reporting live from State Fair Park, Melissa McCready, today's TMJ4HD. <laughs> yep.